What if your most private data, your medical records, your bank logins, your entire digital footprint could be cracked open in seconds? Sounds like science fiction. But with the rise of quantum computing, it's becoming terrifyingly real. And surprisingly, it might also be the key to saving your privacy. For decades, our digital lives have been protected by encryption, especially RSA encryption, a system so strong that cracking it would take even the most powerful classical computer thousands of years. But enter quantum computing, and with it, Shor's algorithm. This quantum method can break RSA encryption in hours, not centuries. And it's not just RSA. Elliptic curve cryptography, which powers many secure apps and blockchain systems, also falls apart under quantum pressure. This means everything we think of as secure today won't be tomorrow. And the threat isn't just theoretical. Governments and corporations are already harvesting encrypted data today, planning to decrypt it later once quantum machines become powerful enough. So, are we doomed? Not quite. The same quantum principles that threaten our data also hold the key to protecting it. Enter Quantum Key Distribution, or QKD. Instead of relying on math problems to secure communication, QKD uses quantum physics, where any attempt to intercept the key changes it, alerting both parties to the breach. In theory, it's unhackable. Then there's post-quantum cryptography, a set of next-gen algorithms designed to resist even the most advanced quantum attacks. Agencies like NIST are working right now to standardize these algorithms, aiming for global rollout by 2030. It's not just defense, it's a whole new offense against data breaches. But quantum doesn't stop at encryption. Imagine processing sensitive data like health records or financial reports without ever decrypting them. That's the power of quantum homomorphic encryption. Or consider detecting fraud or cyber attacks before they even occur, using quantum machine learning to spot subtle patterns humans can't. With these tools, we're not just talking about privacy. We're talking about privacy with superpowers, especially in critical industries like healthcare, finance, and national security. Of course, this isn't plug-and-play tech. Quantum computers are still experimental. They require extreme cooling, precision engineering, and massive investment. Meanwhile, the harvest now, decrypt later threat, is already real. Data stolen today might be exposed in a decade. There's also a looming question. Who controls the quantum keys? Will quantum privacy be regulated, centralized, sold to the highest bidder? These ethical and legal questions must be answered before the tech scales globally. So 
What can you do today? First, stay informed. The quantum race is happening now, and the earlier you adapt, the safer you'll be. Look for quantum safe apps and tools as they begin to emerge. Use secure messaging platforms and pay attention to services advertising post-quantum encryption. Second, support transparency and ethical AI and quantum development. Push for regulation that protects your rights, not just corporate interests. Governments and tech companies are pouring billions into quantum not just to solve big problems, but to control big data. The future of privacy will be written in qubits, not code. And if we get it right, your digital life could be more secure than ever. If not, well, let's not find out. Quantum isn't just the next computing revolution. It's the battle for your privacy. Will you be ready? For more content and intriguing tech, AI and finance updates, like and subscribe to The Tech Radar.